And talking about fame and, and coming with the territory and things like that, um, you obviously you faced many challenges along the way, especially the, the whole censorship thing that, that blew up as well. And and Dee was a powerful voice in that, wasn't he? So how did you feel about all that when it was happening? That I wish we would have stayed out of. You know, that whole, especially like, I think if you're a musician or um, an actor or well-known musician, uh, I think you should keep your opinion about censorship to yourself, you know, uh, or may, maybe make comments of it, but I think we went a bit far with it. Um, I mean, I think it was kind of cool to stand up for your rights, but, you know, I think in the long run, it, you know, it wasn't, uh, wasn't a good thing to go to Congress and try to like take them on because they don't like to lose. And, you know, D did a great job of representing himself. And, uh, they weren't happy about it. They thought they were going to get some drunken, drugged out fool show up and embarrass himself and, you know, put more nails in the coffin, so to speak. And, um, but it didn't go that way. So, yeah, I think it ended up, even though it was a positive thing, it also took a toll, you know, on the band. So, like I said, I just think, um, it's one thing to be involved in or support something, but it's another thing when you head it up and be part of something that's, and get too involved in it because then uh, it can end up hurting your career, I think, you know? I mean, especially with like with Donald Trump, people people actually, there's families that don't speak to each other because they somebody voted for Trump. People have taken that so far. And it never used to be like that. I mean... People say, okay, this guy got voted in, fine. I didn't vote for him, but let's see what happens. But now the division is just insane, you know? And uh, like I said, the people just take it too far now. The whole, all the political stuff that's going on, it's crazy. Yeah, absolutely. Um, in yeah. terms of that, that kind of going to Congress and things, I mean, obviously that's that's your thoughts on it now. I've seen what's happened. At the time, were you all guns for it? Were you... Were you thinking this was the best thing to do, the right thing to do, or did you have doubts at the time? At the time, I thought it was the right thing to do. But, you know, after what happened from it, I said, like, well, maybe we're... That's kind of... I didn't really think about it much till after that happened. Then I said, you know, I'm going to keep my opinion about this stuff. I'm not going to... When people ask me about politics, I'm not going to tell them who I support. Just stay out of it. It's my, that's personal. That's private, you know? And what sort of kickback did you get from, from I don't know, the, the government, the, the people, the powers that be after uh, D stood up the way he did at Congress? Um, I'm not sure, but it seemed like... Uh, I just thought it hurt our popularity. And I don't know if they had something to do with it. I think some of the guys' phones were tapped and stuff like that. Um, and he, you know, it was him, Frank Zappa, and John Denver went to Congress. Of course, John Denver, I mean, he's like a mm. folk guy. Nobody's going to care. But uh, I think, uh, and Friends and Zappa was sort of very risky, but us being sort of this rock band, uh, I, I don't know if they had influence with the radio stations or whatever, but it was just kind of weird. You know, we sort of had a bit of a hard time after that. <laughs> 